Hey everyone, Pupsker here. Today in Genshin Impact, we're gonna go over the weekly boss child at Enter the Golden House. This is a weekly boss located over here in Inazuma. See, Enter the Golden House. And highest tier rewards is the usual for weekly bosses, item billets, weekly loot, and just general gems, adventure rank, etc, etc. Now, in order to unlock this boss fight overall, you need to be far enough in the game. Archon Quest Chapter 1 Act 3, a new star approaches, must be completed, and then you can repeatedly run this weekly boss. So let's go through it, how you can run and fight the boss, and as always, if it helps, like, subscribe, and check out all of my other videos. So this is a water boss overall this with some lightning as by. well. well okay, Amuse so electro me. and hydro. So Step one option. is just don't get hit I by the water, because that hits really hard and then you should be good. You can go in, do some damage, attack, burst a uh, child down really easily. Stage one is easy. It's just a whole bunch of water shots and attacks. So you just keep attacking, avoid all the attacks, and slowly you'll get him down. But as you can see, it's really not much to it. He just keeps shooting at me with the bow, does his little AOE attack, but as long as you have a healer, some damage against Hydro, you don't even need anything huge, you should be good to go, right? Look at the big whale attack, just walk away from it. This stage of a child, very easy. So burst him down as fast as you can, then he goes into the middle. Step back a little bit so that you don't get hit by this. And now he goes lightning mode. Once he goes lightning mode, he will flash across and can sometimes easily hit you. It's not that bad, just try not to get hit with his lightning attacks, right? See, that's just forward attacks, quick attacks, stuff generally like that. So avoid, heal if you need to, hit him with ranged attacks, elemental attacks. But as you can see, if you stay on the move, you will just avoid him and you should be good to go. Now, phase three, final phase for Child, when he goes pretty much Super Saiyan, full Abyss Chaos mode, right? Now, here, you wanna actually avoid his attacks. They can really chunk. He teleports to you, big forward slash on that one. Just slowly poking at him. That's a uh, AoE lightning attack. This is gonna, yeah, just zoop forward, zoop and move. So, just get a good handle of how the attacks work and always stay on the move so you don't get hit by child. Oh, see, that like almost killed me right there. And that was just one hit on Raiden, so you really wanna be careful. Play defensively, right? Stay back if you need to. He can still use water and lightning, as you can see through that attack there. You can still heal up and do a lot of damage, just poking in and out, and then your elements should do it, of course. This is why I'd always recommend a healer if you can't uh, dodge too much or if you're not too confident in your survival. And then we just go like this. Oh, my Raiden actually got hit with that. See, if you get hit, it's gonna hit hard. There's a lot of general AOE attacks. So child's easy, just keep moving and poke at him. Boop. And that's all you need to do for the weekly child attack. So hopefully this general guide did help. Remember to get your loot out of that get your weekly stuff, just general loot, artifacts, nothing massive that time though. But yeah, hope the guide did help. And as always, check out all the other socials as it does help support the channel, Pupsker Genshin. So thank you so much and I'll see you next time. Cheers.